if I can open this. Look, friends. Hi, friends. Welcome to my channel. Today, I have an awesome Dollar Tree haul for you. Guys, I went to Dollar Tree two times last week and then two times this week, and I found a lot of neat items. Uh, some of them um, you've seen before, but some of, most of them are new to me. Friends, let me tell you something. I wore two masks and gloves, so I tried to be as safe as I could. So let's get started. I just wanna show you some of the cute things I found. Look at these little baskets. They're little trucks. There's a little pink one and a blue one. And they're made out of felt. And they are so pretty, friends. I can see them with Easter eggs inside of them, with treats. Listen, I, I bought some, let's see. I think I'm going to fix one up like I did the little truck for Valentine's with some of this candy. Dollar Tree has the Russell Stover marshmallow mini eggs and this milk chocolate favor um, bunny and then your favorite Reese's little peanut butter cups. These will look so cute in there along with some other goodies. But for a dollar, friends, you cannot beat a deal like this. They are so pretty. Next, I found some more of that deco mesh in the lilac and the pink. And Dollar Tree has a bunch of really neat ribbon. Friends, look at this. This is like a mint color. And this one says Happy Easter and it's decorated. And it is in the burlap. Let me just take that off, take the glare off of it. It is so pretty. I picked up several rolls of that. Dollar Tree also has this pastel plaid. It's really, really cute. And then has some Easter egg decorated ribbon. It's also really, really cute. Friends, look at this. This is a soap dispenser. This one is, the bunny one is carrot cupcake scented. Is this not cute? Oh, friends, and the detail is so pretty on it. They have this one and they also have a chick. And the chick is actually sunshine floral scented and it smells really, really good. I thought these were a bargain for a dollar. Are they not cute? Also, I'm on a roll of making the decorated pinwheels. So I bought these bags. Oh gosh, I should have opened them. I bought these bags because I thought that they would make pretty pinwheels and I'll make a video on how quick and easy you can make pinwheels. These are so pretty in the pastel colors. They had the blue. Boy, these things are packaged really, really nice. They're packaged to where you cannot get into them as an adult. <laughs> All right, friends, here we go. Look how pretty those are. And this is a soft pink dot ones. Oh, these are gonna make really cute pinwheels for uh, Easter celebration and spring. Next, I found these, well, let me go on to these fillers right here. I picked up two bags of these vase fillers. These are too cute uh, in the pastel colors. You can throw them in any vase for any kind of decoration and just put a bow on your vase and then you're done if you need something a little extra. I picked up two of these. I also picked up one of these bunny kits. I'm thinking about uh, making an, an Easter egg tree and I think I'm gonna use him to go on it. Another thing I found that I thought was too cool was this bunny garland. Friends, for a dollar, you can't beat it. Oh, 
Oh, and the colors are so pretty. And it's that stiff felt that they're made out of. Look at that. Look at that lime green one. I'll probably not use this as a garland. I'll probably use this on projects that I make for Easter. For a dollar, you just cannot beat this. Okay, so I picked up this. Dollar Tree has these little wooden cutouts, the egg, the chick, and they also had a bunny, but I missed out on that. These are gonna be cute to paint on. I think I'm gonna paint these and put them on that Easter tree I was telling you about. They're really cut out really nice and they're lightweight. And they come with a little jute rope string. I went egg, plastic egg crazy. Dollar Tree has these really cool little bunnies. They're little treat bunnies, Easter eggs. And then I like these. These are kind of funky decorated ones, but um, these will look pretty in a basket or in a bowl or maybe on a reef as well. I also picked up the big size. I also fell in love with this glitter set right here. I will probably use these on a reef. Not a deco mesh reef, that's for sure. Maybe a grapevine reef. And look at these, friend. These are so pretty. They kind of remind me of tie-dye decorated eggs. They just have a big assortment. Okay, and if you haven't checked out their sticker section, they have a lot of stickers. I um, keep a journal and I have a little planner and I just thought these were too cute. Ooh, it's kind of glarish. But then look at this, friends. This is a rhinestone uh, pattern of different butterflies. Well, I don't know where I can show it to you. Look, friends, how pretty is that? For a dollar, I thought that was a bargain. They are too cute. So I picked those up because I think I'm going to put them on something I have in mind. And I also picked up this, these letters in the pastel colors. I just... Uh, I had a Valentine project I didn't get to that I'm going to be using these on, but maybe next year. All right, and also Dollar Tree carries this uh, diamond wrap. This is the neatest stuff. It's, it's got the adhesive on it, and you can just wrap it around vases or any of your projects to give it that elegant touch. You go grab that vase you have to show them as an example. Friends, we didn't have time to film me putting this together, but remember I told you I was going to uh, try my hand at making a Valentine centerpiece? Well, this is what I came up with, and I used this diamond wrap around the vase, and look how pretty it looks. And behind you, Eric, there should be, there's a little dangly diamond little thing, a little brooch. Let me have that. Eric is such a handy cameraman. He does the video and I do the crafting. Look friends, I'm gonna go ahead and add that on. And it's just a little piece of jewelry. It's broken earrings and I just glued them together. And I still have not glued it on top of the margarita glass. But is this not cute? And I think that this diamond wrap is what makes it it gives it that elegant touch. And on those pinwheels, friends, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to use these sacks and turn them into a pinwheel. So easy. I can't wait to show you. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow. All right, friends, the next thing I'm gonna show you 
Dollar Tree has all kinds of stuffed animals, but these were really pretty and they looked high end. And I think these will look cute in a basket or on a wreath, or you might see it on my little Easter tree. I don't know. I just thought these were so cute. Now they had some other ones, but they were kind of like, they kind of look like old shag carpet or something. But these are really high end and they're looking and they're really pretty. So I picked up a couple of these and I was thinking about making a topiary tree, egg tree. So I picked up a bunch of these. These come six to a package and they're really pretty speckled eggs. So that's for another project. I also picked up these pretty foil pastel in the turquoise cupcake holders. They're so pretty. I just fell in love with that color. And talk about cupcakes. I picked up a jar of this lightweight spackling. Ah, let's see this way. Friends, one of these little cans gives you four of these cupcakes. Here's the top. You can decorate four cupcakes with this, with this one little can. Okay, and Dollar Tree is carrying these long uh, glue sticks. I thought that, I mean, five for a dollar, that's not really a bargain, but they're pretty good for when you need that extra long one when you're filming. So I went ahead and picked up a package of those. And um, for my project that's coming up, maybe tomorrow, I picked up some cherry jelly hearts. Yummy, they're good. And some double crisp hearts. I really needed some conversational hearts but friends, they were all out at the, every Dollar Tree that I went to. Okay, another thing that I thought was so pretty at Dollar Tree, and I apologize, I should have opened these up before we started. These ceramic coasters. They have all kinds of different styles, and I picked up four different ones. This one says, do all things with love. This one says, life is beautiful. This one says, you are my sunshine. And this one says, life is a journey. Enjoy every moment. These are pretty for a dollar. They're nice, heavy, and they say naturally absorbent coasters. Well, these are packaged really good. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. Friends, be on the lookout for those. Those are worth their, a dollar. Okay, I also bought some more bunny picks. Uh, the little boy and the little girl. I bought some more of these little carrots. And some little eggs, styrofoam eggs and some more egg picks. And I was lucky enough to find another package of these carrot picks. These are so nice. Okay, let me see. They didn't have a lot of wooden stuff out yet, but I like this uh, Happy Easter sign. I'll probably take it apart and you'll probably see it on one of my projects. These are the only two wooden bunnies that I could find. Somebody said that they were from last year that they had them, but they were new to me and I can already see what I'm gonna do with these. These are cute. And friends, Dollar Tree is carrying spring um, coasters, placemats, napkins, Look at these cute, cute coasters. They're made out of hard felt. And I just thought they would look so cute on a tear tray or um, just on your table. 
They have all kinds of different styles. Unfortunately, these were the only two that I found. And I found some pretty straws to put in my little fake cupcakes. This is kind of the design that they have on their spring, new spring stuff. And I thought these napkins would be good to decoupage with um, or just to put out on your table. They just look so pretty. Okay. And I also found this um, garland of flowers. And again, friends, I don't know that I will leave it intact, but I just thought for a dollar it was a bargain. It's that little hard uh, felt. And they're cute, look at that. Really cute. And they only had one. Okay, I found the Easter egg uh, trees. I know these were real popular at Christmas and I missed out on them in green and white. But I found these, this in irid, it's in the iridescent. And friends, I know it looks puny. I know it looks puny and that's why I bought two, the last two that they had, because you put them together and you can, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with this. It's not gonna look so puny after I get it all decorated. Okay, I got two of those and like I said, the last two, seems like I got the last two of everything that they had. Okay, I'm gonna tell you about these cookies I found. These are um, Oreo cookies and they're Lady Gaga cookies. And they have a little icon right here, or what do you call this little thing? Um, QR code, I think. QR code. Friends, you grab your phone, your camera, you put it over this little uh, emblem right there, and this app pops up. And you can send somebody a message, a Valentine message, and uh, Lady Gaga sings on it. And while we're at it, Let's try a cookie. You want a cookie, Eric? It's green on the inside. Mmm. It tastes like shortbread cookie on the outside. Mmm. That green stuff tastes pretty good, too. All right. Let's put that aside. That's pretty good, isn't it? Not too bad. Kind of tastes like a, a Girl Scout little uh, shortbread cookie. Okay, friends, enough of that. Uh, I bought these, whoa. I bought these three square plates. Two big ones and a little one because I'm going to make a tray. I'm going to paint this, though, in pink, I believe. I'm going to make me a tray for my fake goodies. Do I have green on my teeth? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I just thought about that. You would tell me, wouldn't you, Eric? Sure. <laughs> he, would, he would, he'd let me find out when I saw the video. Look at this cute basket. This is a material basket, and I just thought this was so cute. Um, it's really good quality, you know. You can stick a pot in there like a some a potted plant it would look so cute in there, but I think I have something else in mind for that. Alrighty, I picked up some reindeer moss that I'm going to need for projects. And friends, they have all kinds of candles at the Dollar Tree that are so cute to just have around for spring. Look at these pretty little candle holders right here, and they've got uh, watermelon kiwi scented candles scented in them. Um, this one's melon papaya. I just thought the colors looked so springy. And then I found these. Um, this says relax. I need that. And I just thought these colors were so pretty. This one's relax as well. Friends, these butterflies 
look at that. You can dress them up with these stickers. Oh yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, next, let's see, we've got all this. I picked up some more foam because it's a bargain at the Dollar Tree. And oh yeah, I wanted to show you all these. Okay, so I fell in love with these little chicks. Um, they're kind of squishy. And I thought, well, I'll stick them in either a centerpiece or I'll put them on a reef. And then I drop one and look, <laughs> I just got so tickled. <laughs> For ki kids would go wild, just have those in their basket. Th I thought that was so cute. All right, so I did that. And for my fake frosting, when I'm mixing this with my paints or food coloring, I use um, these to keep it in. It seal, you seal it, sorry, you put the lid on there and it seals really good. And these are Betty Crocker brand and it keeps your uh, fake frosting fresh for a while. Another thing I found at the party section were these cute little margarita glasses and I only picked them up because um, we have a tradition at for birth family birthdays we put bizcochos in a margarita cup so I thought those would be really really cute for that and in case you don't know what a bizcocho is it's a Mexican wedding cookie and nobody makes them better than my sister-in-law Angie okay I'll I love these. I buy these every spring. I buy a bunch of them. I have them all over our wraparound porch. Uh, the bird feeder. And here's the mix that you mix with water and put, put inside your bird feeder. And I have a neighbor, friends. Guess what? He puts wine in his, and he's got a gazillion hummingbirds. And I said, what's the deal? I don't have that many. You do. And he said he puts wine in his bird feeder. I don't know if he should be doing that or not. But anyway... He's got a bunch of hummingbirds all over the place. Okay, I picked up this pot because it fit pretty good in the, ba in the uh, bunny basket. And then I saw this bee, this plant hugger, and I thought, oh, how appropriate for Queen Bee. So I got that. I thought that was pretty good for a buck. And then Dollar Tree is carrying these little tubs in all different co pastel colors. So I picked up this one to put my spring flowers in. And I also picked up some uh, little berries. They have them in pastel colors. They have uh, the little bunch for um, Easter projects. These are purple, or lilac rather. And these are baby blue. And then I picked up some yellow ones as well. Friends, look at these. These picks are cute. They come with three eggs on them. Picked up the pink, a couple of pink, yellow, and the lilac color. These are going on a reef, I believe. And then look at how pretty and high-end looking these um, tiger lilies are. They're so pretty. I'm gonna put them also with my other collection of flowers to go on my spring reef. Okay, before I get to the big bunnies, let me show you, I know this is not spring, but Dollar Tree is carrying these um, disinfectant wipes. Friends, it's good to have these in your car or in your purse. These are really, really good and they don't dry out your skin like some do. And of course, I picked up my favorite a package of makeup cleansing wipes, the cucumber. And I also picked up this uh, petroleum jelly in the cocoa butter. Oh, friends, it is so good on your hands. You put it on before you go to bed on your hands and you wake up the next morning and your hands are so soft and good for a dollar. Can't beat that. Friends, look at these cute egg containers that would be great for the prize egg or uh, just to fix for each one of your kiddos or maybe a friend. But let me tell you what I do with these or what I've done with these before. We always have had uh, a, 
an Easter egg hunt for the little ones. We have one for the teenagers, and then we have an adult one as well. And I usually pack these for an adult, and I put a bow on them. And my prize egg for each adult, the ladies, if I can open this. Look, friends, I usually pick up these plastic wine glasses that are decorated for Easter. This one says, I only hunt wine. And guess what? The wine bottle is inside of it. You buy a little four pack of the wine of wine to put in it. And then for the ladies, I usually put a little pair of earrings. I'm always on the lookout during the year for thing, for jewelry on sale. So I usually throw in a pair of earrings or a bracelet or a necklace, something like that. But that's my prize egg. And for the guys, I usually have um, a little glass that maybe would say Crown Royal or uh, a little Dr. Pepper bottle with the little cinnamon liquor stuff. I don't know, the little sample size. and. Fireball, there you go. And I think it's got a little devil on it, doesn't it? Whew, anyway, um, and a lotto ticket. That's what I do for the guys. But everybody's a winner at my house for Easter. Everybody gets a prize. Friends, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this uh, Dollar Tree haul. I will be um, showing you what I'm doing with some of this stuff coming up in the next videos. In the coming month. Uh, meanwhile, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget, if you haven't subscribed, be sure and do so and hit that notification bell so that you can be alerted when we upload new material. Friends, meanwhile, leave footprints of kindness wherever you go. Love y'all. Bye.